Does pizza taste better cooked in an oven or an air fryer? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. We are no stranger to the air fryer. We've no. compared it to actual frying and we found that it may be a healthier option, but for the most part, it is not a tastier option. We also compared using the oven to the microwave and found out that hot wings and bagel bites were well worth that extra oven time. But what we have not done, that many of you have suggested we do, is compare items made in the air fryer with those in the oven. Because if an oven is better than a microwave and a deep fryer is better than an air fryer, then is an air fryer better than an oven? Oh no, I, I don't have my graphing calculator. I left it in high school. <laughs> it's time for Worth the Wait, oven versus air fryer edition. Okay, we're gonna taste something that's been cooked in an air fryer and then something that's been cooked in an oven and guess which one we think was cooked in the oven. Oven. We'll, we'll decide okay. if it was worth the wait to be cooked in the oven. Oven. And then the loser who gets more wrong will get burned by Chase. As you can see, we can't. Okay, guys, we're gonna kick things off with some classic Foster Farms crispy chicken tenders. Oh, chicken tenders. Classic oven version takes 15 minutes to cook at 400 degrees, while the air fryer cooks in 12 minutes at 390. The time's pretty close on this round, but you're gonna have to tell me which plate holds the oven tendies. Dang, that's a dry tender. Yeah, and I don't know if that's... I'm gonna hold this in my right hand, and then I'm gonna go... Of course, they're the same tender. Well, but not the same tender because you're eating different tenders on each plate. It's the same brand of tender, just cooked in different ways. Correct. One of them is an oven, one of them is an air fryer. I, I was listening. Um, there is a there's a clear, win clear winner difference. Very, I, and, I, and I'm not going to give it away. I mean, we'll talk about the differences after. I mean, I think I'm ready to guess. So when you vote for the oven, are you voting for the one that you think doesn't taste as good? Because you think the air fryer tastes better? I'm not going to discuss that, that after I, this guess. Actually, I mean, I just, you own an air fryer, right? You have yeah, a distinct have, advantage. No, we got it like two weeks ago. No, 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 one of them is definitely a whole lot better. We've only tasting. done grilled cheese in there. I just don't know what it means that one of them tastes so much better. Okay, All you're right. going to put your hand over the oven tendies. Three, two, one. Okay. The oven tendies. We disagree. Are on. Red side. Yeah, and they're, this is way better over here. Oh no, I thought these were way better. Those tasted like trash. I think it might have just been the tender I got. Like I literally, got a, I got a real. Look at how thick that tender is. Hmm. If I get a, this is like a nugget of a nugget. Flavor is better. And that's coming from the owner of an air fryer, but I haven't done tendies in it. I think it's negligible. Um. So I don't think it's worth the wait. Something happened with the breading. It's only three minutes difference. This tastes so much better, I don't know why. Like, I don't understand what happened. That tastes like it got, something got contaminated. I don't taste it. Well, for me, it's worth the wait. For Link, it's not. I figure that out in the graphics. Okay, in front of you, we have DiGiorno's traditional crust pepperoni personal pizzas, okay. one on each side. These personal pizzas took 18 minutes in the oven at 425 degrees and eight minutes in the air fryer oh. at 350. So That's some a big significant difference. time difference. Hmm. Stevie. Yes. Do hmm. you know the science behind the air fryer and why it can get away with an eight minute cook? I don't do you, and you're going to tell me right now? No. He, he does that a lot, doesn't he? He'll ask a question. And you know he just want he just wants I'm, to tell you. You know what? This is one of the rare cases where I don't actually know the answer. Oh, um, and uh, that was sarcasm. Go ahead and comment. Um, the uh, I told my wife when she mm. said, "Hey, we're getting an air fryer." I said, "Yeah, but we already have an oven." But she got it anyway. This is difficult. Well, hmm. Neither one of them are as crispy as I would hope they would be. Huh? This is very difficult. Okay, I have a guess. Okay, you're gonna put your hand over the oven pizza. Three, two, one. I'm just blindly <laughs> guessing. <laughs> yeah, it's on Link's side. Yeah, well, there's a slight crispiness in the crust that I did not get on this. And the time difference is 10 minutes, so. But look, you can see, like, see how the cheese got kind of burned and crisp? And even some of the peppies? Well. That's why I call it pepperoni. Because I, I like things to be fast, like that, the air fryer. For me, the taste is almost the same. 
it comes down to ten minutes, and that it's it's the oven is definitely not worth waiting another. 10 I agree. Minutes. With, I agree with that. I think they're slightly crispier, but not enough to make a difference. So we're in agreement. Not worth the wait. If you didn't know, you should know that they brought back fancy fast food over on the Mythical Kitchen channel. Josh is making fancy. Uh, well, he's making fast food very, very fancy and very, very expensive. Oh, but you yeah. can watch it for free. Think about that for a second. Hey, not Mythical Kitchen. Zero dollars. What do we got here, Stevie? Okay, I have an answer to your question. Conventional ovens work by producing heat from... Ooh, Link, I wouldn't touch that. Well, well I guess we didn't give you what silverware, is though. There's salmon fillets. Oh, we did give you silverware. Reach oh, to your other side for yeah, silverware. I do have a fork. Yeah. Uh, I, thought, I thought he had touched the fork. <laughs> so conventional ovens work by producing heat from an element. The heat is slowly dispersed through the oven over time. In the case of a convection oven, it's sped up by the use of the fan. But air fryers use rapid air technology to create heat instead of an element, and it helps heat them up much more quickly, and they're smaller. So that's the answer to the question that you asked. I got a so, new question. Yes. How do I get this on my fork? <laughs> well, fork you're from... managing to get a lot of it off the plate. Um, okay, me? so these are frozen sockeye salmon. Oh my gosh, you are going to stab him in the hand. I got to use my Sam hand, man. Don't stab me. Okay. They're salmon fillets from Target, which we thawed before cooking. The classic oven version takes 16 minutes at 350, and the air fryer takes nine minutes at 400. Wow, well, it's about half. Okay, so now we understand the technology, so I can go back and tell my wife that maybe she was justified or just a fried. <laughs> <laughs> baby, you're just a fried. <laughs> I try, try that on for that. So I, I, you, you're going handsies? Yeah. I just, I, I can't feel with a fork. I'm glad I've gotten used to eating salmon. Is that your hand? Because I usually would be like, ooh, I don't even like salmon. And Rhett would be like, ooh, he doesn't even like salmon. But now I'm like, oh, I think I kind of like salmon. Wow, nine minutes and 16 minutes. One of these is dramatically tastier to me. I'm finally tasting the difference, y'all. I feel like I'm back. To me, it's not so much the taste, it's the texture. Okay, I got to guess. Okay, or the oven salmon, three, two, one. Over here is better than me. Are you with me? No. no. I said oven was over on my side. So the oven, how... salmon, is on Rhett's side. Yeah. Well, this one, I mean, it does, they kind of look the same. To me, it Maybe, came I down to. I think I was just eating the skin off of that one. Well, yeah, if you just go <laughs> skin versus that. flesh. Is that what was happening? That'll be a problem. So I'll tell you, the difference I noticed is there was a slight increase in succulents in the one in the in, in the, uh, the oven. And see, Nicole, she's nodding at me. Yeah, it's juicy. She is juicier. And there's this something one, about the air fryer that takes out some of the beauty of the salmon. I want the salmon beauty. So you're saying this one's juicier? This one's juicier. I feel like I'm in the twilight zone. <laughs> well, you know what? Maybe you're in the market for an air fryer. <laughs> 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 I think Wait, we found the target that's mark. That's not what are I'm saying. Are you saying though. that? Yeah. What are you saying? That I'm you saying can't this taste one the tasted better. This one oh. tastes better, and it tastes so much better that it's worth the wait for me. But again, <clears throat> we're not on the same team this game. I am. I'm going with the air fryer. <laughs> <laughs> it's French fry time. Oh, okay. Before you are a right of golden fries, the classic oven version takes 23 minutes at 425, and the air fryer takes 10 minutes at 400. <laughs> oh gosh. And first of all, uh. they, they both should just be done in a deep fryer. Let's get real about this. This is a mistake on both sides, regardless of how the outcome uh, is. We, 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 do, we do fries in the oven sometimes, and the key is you gotta really let them have it. <laughs> let them have what? The heat, you gotta make them crunchy. Is this the same type of french fry on both sides? Yeah. Yeah, they're- I mean, they're frozen like, fries, so I mean- This one tastes like it was marinated in soap. Is that something you can do? Uh, we did not marinate anything in soap. Gosh, you're right. You taste the soap? <laughs> yes, it tastes horrible. These over here, I don't taste soap. No, I taste soap on your side. What? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> yes. Are you freaking serious? The soap is over the here. The soap's on your side. No, it's not. Yeah. No, it's not. I put a thought in your head and then made you thinking about <laughs> this place. Well, now I'm confused, man. These are these are horrible. They taste like soap. <laughs> these are good, and I don't even know what I'm supposed to vote for in light of that. 
Okay. I'm so got, wait, to clarify, you both think the other's plate tastes like soap That's still? soap over there. Okay. Yeah. Over All there. right. Here we go. Over the oven in three, two, one. Over the oven and through the woods. <laughs> I'm voting. I, I, I don't know anything. I think they got soap I'm on so the, confused. the air fryer's got soap in it. Okay. The oven fries are on Link's side. Oh, you got it, bro. You got one right. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm it, like... My mind is so screwed up right now. <laughs> Those taste real bad to me. You know what? what the fries themselves are horrible. What brand name fries are these? Just let's All right, uh, let's drag them. Okay. Okay, well, wait. So what's the conclusion here? I don't Link know. Link is confused. Thirteen minutes. And this is difference. the first thing that Rhett likes from the air fryer. That's uh, the conclusion. These are the air fryer. Yeah. Uh, it's not worth the wait because the air fryer is good. It's my opinion, but I think Link disagrees. Well, tell me, tell me what I believe. There's soap on yours, but they're oh. from the uh, oven. These taste like soap to me. Right, and this is an air fryer. So the oven. But to me, they don't taste like soap, and that's why I like them. <laughs> so these that taste better to me, that you don't like, I would be waiting 13 minutes. For soap. For, for according you. to you. For me. So. Figure it out in the graphics. I'm just going. <laughs> Okay, guys, these look really good. You have turkey legs in front of you. Oh, man. And one the classic, leg on each side? Two legs on each side. The classic oven version takes 1.5 hours at 400 degrees, while the air fryer takes 40 minutes at 400 degrees. Huh. Mmm. That's a tasty leg. That's pretty good. And I don't, and I'm not, usually I don't get the turkey leg at the state fair. They look great, but then you get it and you're like, uh, no, that's mine. Whoa, 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 I got a honker over here. Honker, honk. <laughs> this is twice as big. Does the, air, does the oven make it bigger, too? Mm -mm. Oh. Mm. Mm. Whoa. One of them's greasier. There's a huge difference here. And one of them's a little drier. Wow. They, they both tasted good, though. But the one in the oven was cooked. They got a lot of salt on them. That helps. The one in the oven was cooked an hour and a half versus 40 minutes. So did it dry out over time? I have to think so. Um, is that the plate? Yeah, you got it. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Let's hurry up and get it before I get confused. Okay. Are you using your drumsticks as your? Yeah. Okay. I'm you want a drum roll? Put your hand and your drumstick over the oven cooked turkey leg. Three, two, one. Do we agree? You disagree. We disagree. disagree. So, so you think this one's drier? Yeah, so the one that's more succulent is from the oven if we're going with the salmon rule. No, the longer it's in Somehow the this got more complicated. It's in the but oven longer, which means it's probably uh, gonna yeah, get dry. The salmon took longer in the oven, but it was more it was more succulent. So that's the why I went. The oven wow, legs are on Link's side. Yeah, so is the, the rule stayed true. So I was wrong. <laughs> so, yeah. So this is crazy. Now both of them tasted good. I would enjoy. Oh, so you both. feel crazy too? That I, makes me feel better. I would. I would enjoy both of them. But the thing I don't understand, the science I don't understand. This cooked for an hour and a half, and it's way more juicy than the air fryer that cooked for forty minutes and dried it out. Lower temperature. Lower temperature. That's the science. Yeah. Um, I don't know. For Do me, I, can we ask the graphics team? For For me, I just think these are worth the wait. Again, but you you like these better because you like the dry turkey. I just don't like turkey. I'm a ham man. There's a ham man. All right, so make sure you put ham man in the graphics. <laughs> Good, there it is. Uh, so, okay, that means I win. I got four out of uh, five correct. That means, Link, you get burned, man. I know. You're the reason we haven't gotten an Emmy nomination. <laughs> oh, God. Whoa, that, that was, you man. You feel that, That Chase? was, cool. that was, it seems he, like he really believed that. <laughs> Okay, as Link, let's uh, that marinate a little bit. Uh, the frozen food items that were worth the wait are gonna be figured out in the graphics. Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. Hey, I'm Zach from Albany, New York. I'm hiking the Four Pass Loop in Colorado, and it's time to spin the Wheel of Mythicality. Green screen. Yeah, I don't believe it. I, I don't believe it for one second. I didn't hear any birds. It is beautiful, though. Yeah. Click the top link to watch us decide what the best gifts are for some strange scenarios in Good Mythical Morning. And to find out where the Will of Mythicality is gonna land. This looks almost like a curly fry, right? It does. First of all, do you want it? 
It's too hot. You just flick it's it right hot. out of the fryer. It's not hot. Owie. Hot little mindset. It's not though. <laughs>